Marty has had a hard time keeping his grief from interfering with his professional life. Um, I had a, I have a, one of my patients, one of the children in my practice, um, has a father who's a recovering alcoholic. And the father and I thought it'd be a good idea if sometime we took his child, his son, and the, the father and I went together to one of these uh, AA meetings. They have open meetings. You may know about them, these open AA meetings. Yeah, I actually uh, do the same thing with, with my patients. Okay, well then you know. So, so people talk, and it seemed to be a good place to take the child, uh, kind of a safe place to get a sense of what his father's doing. It's, it's, it's a good, we thought it was a good idea, too. Grieving for Susan, his dead collie, has turned Marty into a chronic malingerer. So I was um, going home from work in my car, and by the time I got home, I was spending the time the way I liked to, you know, with my thoughts about Susan, and it came time for me to go to the AA meeting. I didn't want to go. I wanted to be with Susan. So I called up and um, made an excuse that I uh, had a, a minor automobile accident and it skidded on the road and hit a tree. And I let him know I was fine so he wouldn't worry and all that sort of thing. Didn't want to worry the son either. The trouble is that the next day he uh, called me up and he's uh, um, started quizzing me about the accident. He went into all these details. Um, yeah. What kind of car do you drive? Um, what kind of tires do you have? I don't know the brand of my tire so I had to make up a name of a tire and yeah. then he wanted to know the exact street corner and uh, I told him I mean I just made up one that came to mind and it happens to be a well-known one because he knew it so he asked me whether I was going around the right hand was it was the west side or the east side of the corner he and I so I made up the corner and he said well I he told me he thinks that the oak tree is there that I hit the oak tree or the maple that was next to it. I mean, it was, yeah, I kept making this up as I went along. And finally, I, he, he said that he, he was, as a recovering alcoholic, he was responsible for intervention and helping other people. And, and I think that the cause of your accident was um, drinking. So I want you, he said to me, to meet me for coffee tomorrow on your way to work so we can talk this over.